Hey, what's up everybody? Welcome back to my channel. This week's vlog, we will be continuing with the preparations for my husband's return home from army training. So we're about three weeks away from me being reunited with my husband in Virginia and a month away from my husband getting home. I have a quite a few things on a list left to do. So if you watched my previous vlog, it'll be my month away, week one pre preparation vlog. Go ahead and watch that before you watch this. If you're interested to see what I did last week, I did a lot of kitchen organizations. So this week, I'm going to be starting off with, I'm really excited because I've been at work all day not expecting to actually start filming tonight and I got my wedding photos in and if you saw my weekend vlog number two you know I ordered these and they are finally here so I'm going to start getting those placed and I'm going to start with the bedroom um, frames since I'm getting ready to go to bed and I figure that's a quiet winding down activity the other pictures would be going in to the living room and it'd be a little more hands-on activity and a little more active and I definitely need to wind down I just got done with a block party thing for my work um for the end of the summer so that is why I have makeup on just so <laughs> just in case you were wondering so Anyways, let's go ahead and we're going to get started putting these pictures into these frames. So, here we go. So, I am a little disappointed because this frame got broken before we even got to put pictures in it. But, um, we can figure that out later. So, it is a bit dusty because it's been kind of just hanging out. But, I'm going to go ahead and start getting some pictures placed in this. So, I have three smaller pictures of this one this one and this one to put in there and I think I want to put this one in the middle and the one of us dancing and cutting the cake on the other side I think I like that so oh it's so cute and I just like as they're very simple pictures and so cute all right the first one is done and i love it it is super cute um i found out this glass right here is separate from the rest of the glass so i can replace that that'll be something maybe i do down the road i know there's some probably some way that i can find a little piece of glass that i can put there but for now it looks good and i think i'm gonna put it where it is supposed to go which is right behind our bed so give me one second so that is placed now it looks super cute It'll probably be adjusted eventually but for now i am happy with it okay so the next frame i need to fill is this it's all five by sevens so i think the rest of the pictures that are in here are five by sevens i'm gonna try to figure out ah this is so stuck so i have doubles of some so we will see. So I have that one. Ah, the glare is real. That one. We have that. That. That is so cute. Love that. Love that. Love that. <laughs> so much love here. Okay. I'm going to have issues choosing, so I'm going to kind of play with this a little bit. Okay, I think I have them placed where I want to. Oh, it was so difficult. I just couldn't decide, and then I had these two, and I think I decided I want those in my frames out in the living room, and I just couldn't decide where I wanted, but I think I'm happy with how they're placed now. These are kind of more intimate, like, pictures. I guess except for that one. I might switch out that one. <laughs> I don't know. It's still kind of intimate, I guess. And since they are in our bedroom, it's kind of a more special thing. Um, I don't know. I keep messing with it. I'm like, I don't know 
which pictures I want to keep. I know I want that one because it was kind of a special moment. It's like, um, and we're looking at each other and everything. And I love that. So those three are staying. So I may play with it some more. We'll see. Okay, I think I have this set. I kind of wish I did do some black and white pictures, but it's so hard for me to choose which pictures I want in black and white and which ones I don't. So there's a terrible glare on this. Anyway, and now there's a brush one. So I'm super happy with that. Let me go ahead and get that on the wall. All right, it feels good to finally get this up there. I think it's a little crooked, but no matter. Looks good, happy to get that done. Just a short little task to get these up on the wall in our bedroom tonight. And it makes me happy that I'm one step closer to getting my to-do list done. So that is all for tonight. I will probably not do a vlog tomorrow night or I'll probably not video anything tomorrow night. Um, if I do, it's going to be for the fair. So we'll just see. Anyways, I will see you all whatever next day I film. <laughs> hey, coming at you from the Walmart dressing room. I am going to be trying on some clothes. Get ready for fall because once aquatic swimming season's over, I gotta start dressing up again. So, I need some clothes. So, here we go. <laughs> Hey everybody, I am home. Just got home from Walmart. Unloaded all my groceries. I had to get an oil change and I had a lot of shopping to do since I skipped my Walmart chip trip last week. I had to get dog food, rabbit food, all that. So that should have me ready for when my husband gets home as well as the oil change. They also changed my air filter. They ended up giving me a free oil change, which was really, really nice. I was kind of excited about that, but I did have to go clothes shopping. Um, for the fall, since um, summertime, we usually typically just wear our um, t-shirts or polos and shorts. Um, since we're out at pools all day, um, during the year we wear more dressy, business casual kind of clothes. So I needed to get some more fall clothes since uh, I kind of burn out on my other clothes. So I got a few things. Um, I got a bunch of tops. I cannot find um, slacks anywhere. So I'm going to go look somewhere else today when my mom and I go out shopping. So so here's what I got. So um, I'll interest, insert a clip of me wearing this, but it has pockets. And I found that out after I was already trying it on. But it is super comfortable. A nice t-shirt dress. So, um, yeah, and it's a decent length. It almost hits, it's just like right above my knee. I have really long legs though. So, and then it has a nice cut on it. So, um, these weren't work related, but I needed another pair of gym shorts and they have like shorts underneath them as well as zipper pockets, which I was kind of excited about. So I figured I'd try, give them a try it try since I am super usually super picky about like my shorts so I'm gonna give these a try and then here are three different like v-neck type shirts three different colors so they're all kind of like muted fall colors which I super enjoy and they were um 4.44 each I don't remember the price on that um unless it has a tag still which it could oh there it is it might have been on sale. I can't remember. I don't know where the tag is. Um, next, I got this sweater. It has nice big pockets in the front. I can just kind of shove my phone in. Um, and it matches all those tops perfectly. It's also a different color than all the other sweaters I have. Since I have black, a black one and a gray one. And it also has kind of this heathered texture to it. Which also makes it really good for the fall. Underneath, I got this tank with these, like, frilly sleeves. Um, this sweater will go perfect over it. It has a nice pattern on it. And it's long and baggy, which I love. Um, our office gets super cold, so the sweater will be really nice over it. 
as you can see it is perfect so that is what I've got so far and I am really happy about my haul today I think this will get me through the fall I may go shopping a little bit more in the winter time um actually this other sweater I got from Walmart might actually go with these too I like this one too that I got in the fall a couple or spring a couple years ago as well. So I am really thrilled about um, all of the stuff I just got. Um, I have one more week before I can start wearing them since we're in a shutdown mode right now. We're doing maintenance to our indoor pool. So a lot of what I'm doing right now is cleaning stuff. Um, but yeah. I am going to be working on a few other things today, um, but most of my day, that was my main task for the day was getting clothes and um, going to Walmart, getting my oil changed. I have a few like smaller tasks I kind of want to do, so we'll see what how the day goes um, before my mom gives me a call. So, talk to you soon. Hey, everybody. So I'm not going to do too much today. It depends on when I get home, actually. So I cleaned the rabbit's cage, watered the animals, and gave my dog a bath. So those are the things that were, like, completely vlog-worthy. But I'm getting ready to go shopping and go see The Lion King with my mom, which I am so excited about. So I've got an outfit haul here. So the green dress that I saw told you about earlier, I am wearing... So, super cute, just like the perfect length. I went ahead and put my hat on, just kind of dressed it down. Got my bracelet from Hawaii on, my usual necklace, and my, <laughs> can't do it, my boots. So, I'm ready for fall now. I'm ready for fall. And I did some my makeup, just nice and light and gentle. So I'm going to be outside. It's an outdoor shopping mall area. So that will be what I'm doing. I might find, film a little bit when I'm out there. But I'm excited to do something a little bit different this weekend. So kind of a countdown. There's two more weekends after this weekend. So three weekends total before I am with my husband again. So that is really, really exciting. So... We will catch up later, I guess. Good morning. Happy Sunday. I've already done my usual Sunday routine of going to the grocery store, getting my Starbucks, and already freeze wrapped some meat. And now I am going to be putting up some pictures. Um, I don't know how much else, how much I'm going to be doing this weekend other than that. Um, since it is Saturday, I kind of just had a relaxed, more, more relaxed weekend. Um, I did more small things, ordering things, bill things, um, got the oil changed, just things that weren't quite vlog worthy, I guess. So, um, I probably will be working on more this coming week, which will be on my next week's vlog. So, but I'm going to go ahead and get some pictures up. I'm also going to kind of map out what I want to do because I'm going to rearrange my gallery wall to be able to put up that ginormous map, <laughs> photo map. So um, that's going to be a part of my plans for the week. So stay tuned for that. Let's go ahead and get these put pictures put up. Ooh, natural lighting. Okay. Anyways, so I have several pictures, eight by tens. I have this one, this one from our little um, reuniting and then his graduation picture, as well as one of our other wedding pictures. So I have this welcome to our happily ever after like palette thing that I'm gonna put, um, I'm gonna put those army pictures there. And then a couple of these, other uh, engagement pictures on the bottom. I'm gonna replace with some of those wedding photos. Um, I just don't know what ones I wanna replace. I love them all. I think I'm gonna do this one that we're laying down. And I think I might do one of the baseball pictures because I do have like three baseball pictures up there. So, oh my gosh, it's such a difficult life. So here we go.
I'm pretty satisfied with that. Eventually, I'll probably have to move some of these pictures around. Um, I'm definitely loving just having some wedding photos on the wall to kind of add to our engagement pictures that are up here. But I do like adding uh, those up there because they're interchangeable. So I can always add up a new picture <sighs> as like we kind of grow together. And since that's like this year's kind of theme is the army stuff, um, I think it goes really well up there. So <sighs> I'm probably going to have to move these three over here somewhere eventually. I don't know where. And then that canvas is going to go up in that top corner. And I have to put this somewhere. And I'd rather have it closer to the bottom since it is something that we're going to be continually adding to. So <sighs> that just makes things a little more complicated. So <sighs> work in progress. So let's see if I can figure out what I'm going to be doing. That was a long process. There are spiders on this couch and I gotta fix that. That was disgusting. So if you saw me like throw all the blankets off, that would be why. Um, anyways, I am super happy. I'm gonna fix that picture. I got that up there, which I didn't record because I thought I was gonna die. Um, got the map up and moved those two pictures there. And then that wedding picture, like underneath our little wedding uh, shadow box. So, it's kind of like a wedding side. It's super kind of cute. So, super kind of cute. Okay, I have issues today. Anyways, I'm going to adjust that picture and this wall is done. super itchy now because I like went and vacuumed all my uh living room like all the corners and stuff and behind the couch because there was like a whole bunch of spiders and that was disgusting so um I went and like threw all of the blankets that were on the couch in the washing machine and like washed them twice because I'm like I ain't no spiders gonna get me vacuumed everything and now I'm gonna go ahead and give you a little show of what else I added because I got I have one more picture frame to fill you can see it behind me actually see that picture frame right there because I didn't get an extra four by six one of the pictures that I am I did put in and I think the blue frame balances out like the yellowness of the picture or behind the in the background of the picture so I think that is super cute and then over here I have another picture in that frame so I have a lot of cleaning to do in this living room. It's really, really, really a mess. 
but I am really excited about the wall in general. I did think of a few other pictures that I do want to add um, to our walls, mainly in the entryway, and I think that is my next project. So I'm going to go ahead and get those ordered, and then I can work on the entryway. Um, anyways, I have some laundry to do, and then I might order pictures and do some bills, and I will check in later on. All right, it's come time for me to close the vlog. Um, I didn't do too much today. I did a lot of laundry and stuff like that. And then you saw me put up all the pictures and a lot of little things this week that needed to be done that were probably not too exciting. But anyways, stay tuned for next week's vlog. Go ahead and give me a thumbs up and hit subscribe if you want to continue to follow my husband and I's journey in this military lifestyle. So I will see you all next week.